Salam from Music City. And this is the very first time that I'm meeting Nick in person, the uh, producer that I've been working with over the last year. So today what we're doing is we're laying the foundations and part of the challenge of building the foundation of a song is really settling on the speed and the direction and the feel of the song before we jump into recording the track separately. I've got that feeling in my gut. We may have to work out the melody. Yeah. Ah, okay. Uh, we're doing it. Mercy. There it is, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mercy. Okay. Alright, so we got Joey in there. He's kind of tuning up, getting the drum sound right. We got mics on each drum, sometimes more, you know. And then we also have another set of mics farther out. We got our room mics. It's a stereo pair, so two mics and that captures the sound of the room. The sound of drums that we have come to expect on a record, you have to go through this whole process to get it there where you have close mics that capture the, the attack and then mics farther back to capture the sound of the room and the natural reverb of the room. And then once we're set up, then we'll hit record. And yeah. <laughs> actually start recording. Yeah, but I just wanted to show you guys uh, a little bit of what goes on behind the scenes. So we're back in uh, Nick's studio. Right, well, we got the drum tracks cut. Now we're basically going to sift through all the different takes we did. A lot of it is kind of experimenting, seeing what works, what doesn't work. Pick the best pieces. All these different colors represent uh, audio taking from different parts, right? So like we like the very beginning from this one take, the way he did a little fill. And then right here we got this take. And you see this a slightly different shade of green we liked right here a little bit better. So we kind of take the best pieces and make this Frankenstein <laughs> of everything. And then, and then we go in, we do a little bit more polishing. And by the way, this takes many, many hours. It's not like something we're going to do in 15 minutes. If we're going to go to the Jackson. I don't know why I should touch the Jackson. <laughs> So this is a slide, and long time ago uh, in the south, guys would find broken bottles on the ground, and they would take the bottle top, and they would slide their finger through it, and uh, it was a different way of playing their acoustic guitars, because most of the time back in the day, they only played acoustic guitars. They would tune the guitar a different way and play it, and that's sort of how American blues music was created and developed. <laughs> <laughs> you can hear the finger moving over the frets. Whereas with the slide, you don't touch the frets, it only touches the string. So you move it. I can just kind of burn off. Okay. Six months later. Another day, another video shoot out here in Barking, London. And today we're doing the music video for Mercy. So essentially we're shooting this outside part on you on one side and it's gonna keep fading in and out of that. That means there has to be one take throughout. We'll just start with you actually writing a note and then you just tie it to the balloon and let it go. And then it has to end with the balloon just flying up from below and you just have it in your hand again. So it really isn't difficult, it's just we have to do this just in one take. So I'm gonna just, yeah, look, I'm gonna stick out my finger like this. No, I know you're 